G'day guys, Melbourne Scrap over here. Today we're talking magnetrons. Alright, let's talk about the safety issues. So, a lot of people on YouTube and the internet are saying, this little beryllium oxide thing is the root of all evil and is going to kill you. Now, let's take it from a bit more of an objective, reliable source. I consulted a medical source in my family. They mentioned to me that the real issues with beryllium, as opposed to beryllium oxide, is when it's mined, it's in solid form, there's a lot of dust, a lot of particles getting in the air when they're mining it, that causes severe lung problems. This on the other hand, is beryllium oxide. It's in liquid form. It's a coolant. A lot less to worry about. It's not going to give you cancer. I would treat it with respect. I wouldn't drink it. I wouldn't use it as suntan lotion. Treat it with respect. Be careful, but don't worry too much about, you know, dying by dismantling a microwave. And of course, when you're dismantling a microwave, follow all safety procedures. Be careful with the electrical components. Now, how much is this sucker going to earn you? Bang! It's just under a kilo, about two pounds. 40 cents a kilo or 18 cents a pound, 37 cents. Not much, not going to make you rich. The interesting part happens. Now, you can either dismantle it into its subcomponents, as copper, aluminium there. I'm going to put a link in the description below. Please like and subscribe to that crazy Canucks channel. He's got an awesome video on taking, about, taking out all the components of a microwave. I'm not going to do it. But the interesting part is when you maybe flog them on eBay. See if it's working, test the microwave, heat something up, see if it's working. This here is a Panasonic. It's made in Japan, it's quality. So there are guys out there who love to experiment with these things. I call them electric nerds. Good on them. They're willing to pay maybe up to $20 for something like this. So $20 versus 37 cents, you decide what your, what your time is worth. And if you want to list that on eBay, I reckon it's a go. I'm going to give it a go. And a big shout out to Moose Scrapper for that information. I'm going to put his video in the description below. You better like it. You better subscribe. You better give him a go. Because he's probably one of the top scrappers on YouTube. Okay, guys, respect this. Don't worry. Don't lay up all night worrying. And uh, give it a go. Give it a go.